now we are seeing about controlling the dc motor speed here we are using the synchronous rectifier to control the dc motor speed here uh, this rectifier consists of two switches and two diodes usually we will use one diode bridge to rectify that is con that consists of four diodes and one buck converter uh, to reduce the voltage or control the voltage output voltage and buck converter consists of one diode and one switch although here the number of switches is increased we are reducing totally three diodes plus one dc link capacitor okay so this one this uh, converter have the advantage of reduced number of components in this uh, we are providing a supply voltage of nearly 32 volt uh, there is ac volt that is provided to the converter and from that it is directly controlled and rectified at the same time and provided to the DC motor. Here one sensor is used to sense the DC voltage, output DC voltage and provided as the feedback to the controller. I have provided 9 volt and 20 volt as the reference voltages. It will alternatively change for each 20 seconds. We will check the demonstration of this. Now the reference voltage is around 9 volt. And here we are getting the voltage is around 8.8 .8 volt. After 20 seconds, we, the reference voltage will be changed and speed of the motor will increase. Here it is changed to 20 volt. Reference is 20 volt. Here we are getting 19.8 6 volt. And the speed of the motor is also increased. By controlling the DC voltage, we control the motor speed. And here, uh, the, in this pulses will be generated according to the feedback. And here it is provided to the buffer IC which will isolate the driver circuit and the controller and from driver circuit the pulses will be provided to the converter. This is the supply for the driver circuit, this is the supply for the main circuit.